going to turn off the start stream starting now. Um, I'm going to take this image and make it real small. Be down here. Um, I want to hang on. I'm not going to. Can I edit this? I think I can. Give me a moment. Cancel filters because I just want to crop it. It's harder to do that with this because this XSplit is better at editing image on the fly. Nah, I don't think I'll do it. Just take it too much time up. Um, we'll just make it small. The corner. Let's get music up. Let's get accurate music up. Appropriate music. Something everybody likes. Um, I'm actually thinking I'm just going to start up with this I was working on the other day. There's some things I have to fix first. I'm going to draw. See who gets comes on. Oh, I lost <laughs> No, she's not playing Chunky anymore. I'm getting the fuck out. <laughs> I came here for Chunky. <laughs> Can't play Chunky. I think I get demonetized for it. Chat. I don't have Twitter, but I'll say White Kieran. Okay. Uh, so then I already got a request. But we'll leave that up there for when we get. Of course, they would ask for something I can't think of. <laughs> My brain. Um, that was user over at the um, Knuckle Sandwich Discord, Frog Togs, wants a white. Kierman. And they would ask for something. So, um, I'm gonna do my best to draw a white Kierman. <laughs> Through memory. Uh, well, I think they do something like this. It's got, like, some doofy... Like this. Granted, they asked for like the one Pokemon that I had never um, seen before, or I never played that game series, so I don't know anything about it, or why it's a Pokemon at all. And honestly, if Game Freak is gonna purge a bunch of Pokemon, you know, Thanos snap the Pokemon and shit like that, which I say Thanos snap all the time, and I'm pretty sure every time I say it, my friend's like, oh, what the fuck are you doing? I'm like, no. It's a thing. <laughs> like, it, it's- it, Thanos snapping is now just a thing everybody does, okay? We all Thanos snap things out of our life. And, uh... You know, right, Kierman? Right, Kierman? Kiermans? That's, uh... That's a dude, you know. That's a dude that doesn't deserve to exist anymore. It was just some dumb spin-off game, sequel baiting, some chicken thing. Um, all the Pokemon have like this eyes from that generation. That's much better. <laughs> and it's got like something nose like this. It's very upset with its existence. <laughs> and it's got like the white Rasherman. But it's also a Trump supporter because it's white, so. <laughs> right, let's get the other wing of there. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck this Pokemon's supposed to look like. <laughs> Ask for something easy, like Dunsparce. I can do that. I think I can. Uh, and he's got the other thing there, and he's like, yeah, that's White Kierman, right? Okay, because he's got like the, the, the jet stream butt. Let me see if I can spell it. Tangela? 
Draw Wulu. I don't mind drawing Wulu. Okay. Uh, I don't have Twitter, and I'm K Y U R E M. K Y U R E M. <laughs> Hang on. I think I will draw a Wulu. That one seems funner. Um, let's see, we'll do red. Let's see. That's a cute little sheep. I know immediately off the top of my head, it's got like these little thingy things. It's just cute. But then it's got hideous goat eyes. And that's the best part about it. Uh, are they sideways goat eyes? this nothing but fluff with this thing a little easier, though I still think I fucked it up pretty good. Tangala. Okay, that's another one I can do. Uh, let's see. So first thing Tangala's deal is big ol' eyes, sort of black face, Apparently, Tangle is not based on any. Like, Tangle is deliberately like a spaghetti monster. I'm just gonna get the face out of the way. This is also some good warm up streaming stuff. Inadvertently gave it a little smile. Uh, okay. So there's Tangela. Really quick one. Let's see. Okay, so those people asked. Oops. Go to this channel, nobody's asked. Oh my goodness. Cool. Um, 
courtier. That's that big sh uh, shih tzu type of dog. I think I can do that. Uh, people are definitely asking for like Gen 5 Pokemon. And uh, I hate Gen 5. I think most of the Pokemon that need to be purged are Gen 5 Pokemon. I um, need a good color for it. Let's, let's just stick with orange. So... Herdier is the final evolution, right? I think it'd have to be because it makes sense. Alright, shit. Let's... Now that's a giant ass dog, too. So I need to do post some of these up to... too far back. I don't know what it's fucking ears look like. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna have to start saving some of these. And posting them. Shitty art. <laughs> yeah, I got four. I can post in one Twitter. Alright. Um. Let's crop. That way I can wait to get like the next batch of people asking for Pokemon. That's where it is. Um. Crap. Wait. Hopefully none of my porn accidents shows up. Crap, pokies, herdier, JPEG, nah, PNG. Actually, let me create a folder. Oops. Wait, what'd you do? Where'd it go? <laughs> uh, create folder. Not nearly as cute. I apologize. I do like the woolies. <laughs> what a good start to this game. I don't fucking know this Pokemon! <laughs> Fuck it! I accept that. Okay. Go to... Oh, you can't see my... Uh, change my... Yeah, I definitely don't want to be me. Do, 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 do. 
Yeah, you can't see this part, but they're all being uploaded now. Draw, please. Watch on Twitch now. <laughs> Reply. <laughs> Let's see. Um, oh, let's check the comments. See if I got any more. Fruitier. Just white Kierman. I will say though that my hand drawing has gotten worse. Gay okay, hell. It's trending on Twitter right now. Rapper brought says he bought Mi Hell, Michigan. Names it Gay Hell. Ah. <laughs> I think it's a good thing though. <laughs> okay, so he bought the the town of Hell, Michigan, turned it to Gay Hell, and all they fly is pride pl pride flags. Yay! <laughs> That's pretty funny. Uh, uh, still not many people watching. Guess it's like mid afternoon. Um, what's my stream look here? So I'm gonna leave that up, uh, and, but I'm gonna go back to this post here, and I'll try to keep my eye out for people asking for pokey draws. And I'll definitely do Earthbound after this, but for now... Uh, leave that. Let me see. So, his eyes... All you have to do is, if, if you're watching, just speak into chat. Does anyone chat? I don't know. During the Earthbound stream, I'll talk about Animal Crossing news and updates. And I'm actually probably gonna post this one. Just, this is like probably one of the few art streams I'm recording. And we're gonna post on YouTube. Because I think the other thing I have to do with this picture is just outline the butt parts. That's, that's my chat saying here. <laughs> Love it! <laughs> Frog Togs was happy. Okay, so I got... Nobody's giving me pokies to draw. Okay... Eh. 
There we go. Just a little bit of lightness there. Just so you can tell the difference between... Bits. I don't think he needs it for up here. Uh, I was gonna give him a tail for this one, but I didn't want Now the other thing I could do is uh, queue up Mario Paint and draw the pokies of Mario Paint, which would be interesting and different. But we're not going to do that. Maybe another day. I just saw that trending around. I'm like, okay, I'll do that. It's a good way to get people coming by. One viewer still. Thank you to the one viewer who's listening to me and watching this. Ah. No, stop! What was it? I clicked a thing. However, to view 30 followers. Alright, so that's technically done. I didn't need it overdone. Yeah. I was just going to have it all just a sketchy drawing, but coloring it up was not complicated. Oh, it's just I should do the color around his tail. Yeah. Every now and then I have to have a drawing of somebody in a cat suit. I don't know why, it just happens. It's a cat. Save. Uh, I think my print size, yeah. Okay. P and G. keep resaving it, but I'm like, no wait, it's not done yet. Save. If you're watching this and coming into the stream at the moment, I am... Give me Pokemon to draw. Save and save as PNG one more time. Alright, I don't think I have anything else I can technically work on. Everything else I need to work on is not safe for work. Except for this one. And I don't particularly want to work on this one today. I want to draw more. So I'm just kind of sitting around because I have to do a lot of fancy lighting and I'm just not feeling it. <laughs> Let's see. Oops. I'm waiting to see who else wants pokies. Is it Larry? No. Sorry, that's...
Um, I might see if I'll just randomize some Pokemon. So most people are like, oh, I want good art. I'm like, no. <laughs> Pay money for that. You want free pokies. I give you shit pokies. Oh, that's a good picture, too. But it, do it also helps to do, like, some of, like, the dumb ones. So, like, having White Kiergan is not a bad Pokemon to do because it's really dumb. It's easier to do ones I don't remember, have a good reference or good knowledge of what they look like outside of that. So let me see. Random Pokemon. I just don't want them to show me a picture. Random Pokemon generator. Okay, just give me the names. Generate. Oh shit. Yeah, it gives me images. Fuck no. Uh, Pokemon... Generator tools. No, you give me images of the Pokemon. I don't want the images of the Pokemon. Fuck. Pokemon generator. Just give me the names. Oh yeah, good. I can click sprites off. Generate. Okay, good. I have Victini. Uh. Now I'm gonna click it. Okay, now. All right, I have Drifloon. Pangaro, Bellsprout, Illumines, Beware, and Chubchu. Okay, so I can do those. Good. I was worried about natures. Um, generate six Pokemon, all regions, all types. I'm gonna check, uh, still only one person watching. Okay, so let's go back here. Uh, Chubchu, which is a little bear that's got snot. Funny enough, somebody's asked me to draw this dumb thing more than once, and it's another Gen 5 Pokemon that I hate. Except I guess I like its evolved form. Wait, it's got big fucking eyes. It's one of these Pokemon that's like, we already had a bear. Do we need another ice Pokemon? This is one that's for the Purge. Even its evolution form. I'm not. I, and I say that with like. With, a, with very hard restraint. Or I say that like thinking, no. It doesn't deserve this, the hate it gets, but really it gets more like than it should. Because essentially, it's just a bear and a polar bear, and we need a polar bears. Like, why did we get Chubchu or Cub Cubchu when we have... Like, they, why did we get the ice cream Pokemon when they gave us this little guy? That's kind of... Kind of what gets me mad about it. It's like, okay... Did you want to give us an ice cream Pokemon, or did you want us to give us a Sneezy Bear? The other thing is, okay, so the one reason I don't like Cub Chew in particular is, uh... He looks like just any old Nintendo villain. Like, he's an NPC, he's a, he's not a Pokemon. He's a Nintendo background villain. Like, you go to the ice levels, and it, it's like one of these filler enemies that just kind of got thrown away. Cub Chew. Alright. Did that one. So the other random Pokemon is Pangoro. I really like Ambiware. Oh my god, fucking bears. Just noticed this whole thing gave me bears. Uh, Beware is a little easier. I can figure that out. Let's get some hot pink. Ears. That's the only problem with this this bear Pokemon is that it's just these things. But I like it actually. Um. I 
I want it to want to eat you. And I like its big old tail, too. I do like that this one's coming back. I just think it has a strong new design. Um, but it's, a, it's one of those things, like with Cub Chew, it looks like just any other villain or any... It doesn't look like it belongs in the Pokemon universe. It's kind of how I feel about it, essentially. a weird body form. I need to do like this. Yeah. Cause he wants he's going in for a hug. And he's very hungry about it. He's like the pedo bear. Actually here here's uh, beware. Pedo bear. There's your beware. <laughs> He's got like a pedo bear. Even my pedo bear, my memory is not very good. <laughs> beware. The other one, I'm just checking around my dash, see how people are responding. <laughs> All right, so then Pangoro. Well, before I do, yeah, let's just finish up the bear trifecta here. Pangoro is... So here, we're gonna do Pangoro here. I like Pangoro a lot, too. Like, okay, so I give shit... I think maybe... Say, so I don't like the... the Arctic Bear, so his final evolution is really nice. So I, I honestly have no problem with Cub Chew. I think Cub Chew doesn't deserve to be purged. I'll take it back. We, it, it's nice to have a good collection of bears. <laughs> because I like his evolution. And I think his evolution is really good. I just think his uh, the baby form is kind of dumb. Goro has something weird. Yeah, he's like this. He's got daddy chest hair. But I like Pangoro a lot. But it's also one of those Pokemon where it's like, it's probably not going to survive the purge. It might barely survive- <laughs> barely. <laughs> it might barely survive the purge. I don't think any of the bears should be purged. I think all the bears are really good. Oops. Yeah, let me fix this. Pan... Goros... Gonna... Wreck it. Uh, alright, so I did my bear trifecta. Okay. Cup chew. Beware. Now I need one more. So that would be my four. Uh, Drifloom at Looney's Bell Sprout. Maybe the bug. I'm just trying to think if I'm gonna mix four together. Let's regenerate. We click not looking. And what did we get? Pyroar! Ooh, that'd be good. And Smeargle showed up, but I'm not gonna do Smeargle. I, I draw Smeargle all the damn time. 
Mantine, Dustox, Snivy. Oh yeah, Snivy's a little snake dude. I had to remember. Pyroar. Ooh, which version of Pyroar? Okay. Let me double check and see if anyone's giving me a suggestion. Oh, it's three o'clock? Okay, so I'll do... I'll do Pyroar. I'll do male Pyroar. I'll see if I can do that. The music didn't know how to loop on itself. <laughs> oh, it'd be better if I do. Pyroars are pretty cool too, but that's one that won't survive the purge because there's nothing strong about it. And the craziest thing is that it's like... Um, it's got cute little round ears. It just doesn't need to exist. But it's also a Pokemon that's pretty dang cool. So the real question would be... Do we need to remove Game Freak from their own game? From their main series? If they don't have the time and attention to... Because what it feels like, it, this Purge thing that's going on, feels like if Nintendo is pressuring them to finish the game quicker, or the head company is like, nah, we don't need to do this. Because I've been asking for some sort of a Pokemon Purge. But I would say, like, maybe cut out 150 of them. Like, there's no reason to have as many Pokemon as they've been having. Because there's so many Pokemon that nobody ever uses. But then there's a bunch of Pokemon that nobody ever uses that, um, are still kind of awesome to some extent. Like, I like Skunk Tank, Garbodor won't survive the Purge. And I love Garbodor. Like I said, I like Pyroar, but I, Pyroar's and the line are are not the same as uh, Shinx. Shinx has so much more love and affection and battle-ready interest that there's no reason to have Pyroar. Instead of like them trying to figure out how to make Pyroar viable. And then somebody brought up an interesting point. I ran out of space. I made his head too big. <laughs> Somebody brought up an interesting point that, um... Well, okay, so I forgot the intro. My interesting point is that they really aren't figuring out how to do some of this stuff. Like, um... They just don't have time to, like, really figure out how to balance this thing. And I was hoping that uh, at least with like the new main series Pokemon game, they'd go the same mechanics that um, Let's Go Eevee and Pikachu would have. Because Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee do away with a lot of, um, you know, metagame stats that have been haunting the series for way too long, which allows for Pokemon like Pyro to never have an advantage. Uh, Alright, so we're gonna crop these guys and put them together. And I'll probably get started with... Um... Hi, Roar. We're probably gonna get started with... The stream soon. I don't need Lulu. This one's my favorite. I really like X and Y. 
I'm just gonna put that out there. I um, and Goro. But there's here's the like okay the reason Pyroar sucks is because there's a million other better fire Pokemon. Oops. So there's almost no reason to ever use any other fire Pokemon, and they would never make. Um, oh, there we go. That fixes that problem. They would never make a system in which where the Pokemon... Like, small guns are responsible for coming up with these tier lists of, like, underused, rarely used, never used sort of thing. And you want to be able to use some of these, like, Pokemon that are not competitively viable. And I would hope that, like, well, okay, you're making these giant Pokemon a thing... Is that actually something where you can make the weaker Pokemon have an advantage? Like, anybody can have a great Pokemon. Well, you're just gonna make a Giga Hax or Dyna Hax version of the most powerful Pokemon in the game and still be good. Like, it doesn't zero out the stats. Cub, Chew. It's like, if I want to have an entire team- if my best friend ha wants to have an entire team of Zubats and be competitively viable, it should- it <laughs> should have a mechanic that allows you to do that. <laughs> because Zubats are awesome. <laughs> they should never get rid of Zubats. If they ever get rid of Zubats, the game series has failed. Which is why Gen 5 is the worst Gen series of them all, because they thought they could replace Zubat, and they failed with Swoobat. Swoobat is cute, but it's not Zubat. It's not Crobat. It's not Golbat. What they failed as a Pokemon team by thinking they could replace any of, like, replace Zubat. I mean, there's a lot of Gen 1 Pokemon they can definitely get rid of. I fucking hate Goldude, Geodude, Golem, those things. Um, I don't like those ones at all. I even think, like, uh, the new rock Pokemon are at least a little more- I've gotten warmed up to them. I like Machop better, the Chop lines. Um, and I like Lantern and Litwick, those guys are kinda cool. There's a lot of Gen 5 Pokemon I like, so let me just put that out there. There are Gen 5 Pokemon that aren't bad. Alright. So let me post these. I hope you guys aren't annoyed with, um... Mario Paint music yet. Okay, so you're not watching me post these on Twitter. How many people ask for Pokemon to be drawn? They happen to all be bears. I did name my Pangora Wreck and Ralph. Or uh, just Ralph. I don't think it was Wreck and Ralph, but he, when I was using him, it was Ralph. Oh, hey, there's somebody. 
Survive the purge is a question of luck. No, we don't need to remove Game Freak the Pokemon main series. Not all Pokemon can be competitive. Like all the animals not in the world will be competitive in a fight. So that was why, um... Like, they created the, the contests. And I guess they just didn't want to put more effort into making the contests a thing. Because that was a game mechanic in which where it was based on attacks. I don't know why they decided to drop that, because that was a field of battle that made the Pokémon that were not competitive more viable. And in Gen 3, it worked really well. I felt like there was some metagame to it, some battle strategy thought out to it. I didn't give it much of a try in the Auras remake. Um, but I did enjoy the contest battles in the original Gen 3. I feel like when they did it in Gen 4, something broke. And then Heart Gold, Soul Silver also had competitive battles, which are pretty fun too. Something about them going to 3D just made it a lot more difficult for them to get shit done. But they could not, and unfortunately they can't sell the series on 2D sprites anymore. Which, I think is fucking bullshit. I love 2D sprites. I love the art that they did on it. And then maybe the 2D sprites... Like... I don't know. Like they, I felt like they could have more flexibility with the 2D sprite stuff. And then it was just Nintendo forcing them to do all this stuff. I don't like that people think that they're lazy. Um, I don't think that it, they deserve to be called lazy. I just think that they don't have time... And they have investors telling them what to do instead of th letting them have some sort of artistic control. But there is a lot of staff being changed, and it does feel like they got a lot of go-getters in there. Because <laughs> watching the Pokemon Direct, there's... I don't know the name of all the guys. Um, th that one guy with the glasses and the bob haircut... He looks like the the super nerd. He looks so sad in every interview that he's in. Like he just feels like a li he looks like he's had to make sacrifices in his life just by his body language and his energy. And I don't know why he's so sad. <laughs> the rest of the guys, the rest of the the staff look fine. They don't have a problem with it. But him in particular, he's got a constant sad face. Um, I wonder if I can get a picture of him. Let me see. Game Freak E3. And I'll leave this in the recording. Images. Uh, not him. Who's, what's the name? Ishihara? Okay, so Ishi it's not Ishihara. Um... I don't know how to say about Ishihara. Let's see, okay, so here's... Did it say his name? Junichi Masuda Itsugiro. Suwara, these are two of the guys. So let me... I can't really break... Wait, maybe I can do this instead. Because uh, I just didn't want to save the image. Oops. <laughs> This one's it. Yeah, here we go. This guy here. <laughs> that guy. He looks like he's sad in most of the Game Freak interviews. I don't know. Like, look at the recordings of him and all that. He's just... Whether or not he's tired, he's happy in this one. But I feel like he's got other shit going on in his life where having to work on Pokemon is not the job that makes him happy in the day. <laughs> And I'm like, what's going on, dude? <laughs> Maybe he's like looking at Pokemon Sleep and thinking, what's going on with this franchise I used to love? <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna pause the stream. I'm just doing one more round to see if anybody wants me to draw a Pokemon for them. Real quick and dirty. I'm gonna do a break. I need to turn on... I need to make a lot of switches anyway. Um... 
Nobody over here wants us a crowbat? Oh, Abby wants a crowbat. Okay, I'll do a crowbat. <laughs> Abby wants crowbat. <laughs> she made it just in time. <laughs> I'll make it nice and special for her, too. Let's see. I'll do my best. It's a very angry bat. Anything for Abby. <laughs> and then it's got like a weird foot thing going on. I think the missed opportunity of Pokemon Let's Go Eevee is that they just didn't decide to give us the evolutions of the Pokemon. And maybe that's what they felt like. They can get away with not doing any of the Pokemon, like, okay, well this game will never have it, these Pokemon it, because we just can't actually have the Pokemon in the main series. Like, we, we were able to get away with it with Let's Go Eevee, so let's do it again for this one. And I'm like, like, not everybody liked that decision to begin with. Crobat is awesome. That's why it's not looking half so bad. Eh. Everyone's gonna like look at like, what the fuck did? You why does Panda Beware look so shitty? It's like it's not a, I don't know him that well. I even think I'm fucking up Crobat. I think his, uh, I don't think his wings do what they do in here. I'm just like, it's Crobat. I know that he's got, like, those little feeties. Crobat. For Abby. Mooch. Let's put it in here. Save. And then I'll come back to this another day, maybe. So let me do this. Crowbat. Crowbat's easy. I've drawn him more than once anyway. He's... They're the best. They're one of the best Pokemons. I like Pokemon that are versatile. For sure. For sure. I'm just checking to see if anyone else asked for anything. Nope. That's gonna be it. And... <laughs> Posting... Okay, so that's gonna be the end of this. I'm gonna take a break. I'm gonna... Well, I'm ending the stream. No more Pokemon drawing for now. Uh, goodbye. Uh, thanks for joining YouTube. If you're watching this after the... If you're watching this on stream, we're gonna do Earthbound in a moment. But uh, for, goodbye for now. I'm taking a little short break. Gonna pass some music. Gonna set up Earthbound stream. So thanks for watching.